<laughs> Wait, is Roxy? I'm so sorry. Come here. Hey. Uh, hey, guys. What's up? Thanks for coming back to the new home. We got Dylan on the couch over there. What's up, D-Man? We got Mateo shooting on the new camera. We got from my Uncle Ryan. Hooked it up. <laughs> yeah, he flipped that thing, dude. It's so wild. Oh, tweaking over there. How are we doing? So today, we're going to go and ride our bikes to Target with no emissions, you know. Zero emissions will be good for the body, good for the earth. Get some seeds. I just turned my soil in my little garden box in my backyard. And then we're going to hoe it up and then plant some seeds. Do a little of that. Right, Dylan? Yep. Oh, Dylan's slapping on the debris sticker. Um, here's the debris sticker. Special thanks to Joe from Debris. Going to get things running today. So we're going to... Dude, Dylan, what you eating, boy? <laughs> Give a little ASMR. These are stale. <laughs> The man. Let's go check out the backyard. We got the plants, trees, flowers. All right, so here we got the uh, garden box. Yeah. This Compost. So, what is that called, Dylan? Fruit. I know. It's compost. Compost. <laughs> so what is going on in that box is we had dirt in there and stuff, and we put all of our choppings from vegetables and other things. Just chuck them in there every time we get a chance. It just put the lid on it and shake it. Uh, I don't see any worms. <laughs> they got out the top, maybe. I already added some compost to the soil, so it's good soil right now. Great mineral rich soil, and we could grow plants really easily. Jeff is blowing next door. Yeah, I know he's taking over the mic. <laughs> Scratch that thing, girl. Scratch that thing. <laughs> yeah, boy. We're probably going to switch to the GoPro when we get on the little bikes. I don't want to break this new camera. So we're going to switch to GoPro right now, and we're going to head on down to Target, and I'll let you guys know what's up once we're down there. Let's get it! about oh heck yes brother all right gently move this this way okay so i'm thinking hmm which one should i get these thick guys <laughs> or these long skinny johns yeah long skinny johns. long skinny johns or we'll get some long skinny john cucumbers squash let's try squash okay perfect some radishes oh perfect radishes radishes cucumbers and should I do watermelon? Yes. To try and just sugar babies. Sugar baby. Sugar baby. <laughs> so we got watermelons. These are my sugar babies. We got cherry bell. You already know those girls. Summer squash, the butter dish kind. And we got long skinny cucumbers. <laughs> So the thing about these seeds, they do cost a couple bucks, which is which is all right. We're just showing the uh, easiest way for the common man to go out and plant his own garden. Yeah. Yeah, that's what we're doing. But you could also, if you want to put more work into it and be more sustainable with it, you could get most of these seeds or trimmings from your plants and just put them in the floor and they will grow. That's how it works out in the real world, in nature. But we're showing you the more uh, modern, practical way of doing things. What's up guys? Uh. Yesterday when we got back from Target, it got stormy. As you can see right now, it's not the best weather, but we're trying to bust out these videos and get them going. This video uh, actually got moved to a Wednesday instead of Tuesday. Today, really sick. So we got Bree. Say what's Hello. up. Bree, she's a little neighbor girl. We got Dylan. We're gonna teach about gardening. We got the seeds in Target yesterday. Earlier night, Bree, we came out here and we got this all looking good. Yep. Uh, ready to plant some vegetables, plant some food, and do it right. <laughs> We're going to plant tomatoes and everything. All right, to start off, Dylan, you want to show us what we got in Veggie Land? Here, you can. Veggie Land. We got some summer squash. Squash. We got some cilantro. <laughs> we got some cucumber. Cucumber. Yum. Watermelon. Ooh, that'll be fun. Radishes. Ew. So, Bree, where are you at? Have, a, have you ever planted your own food? Yes. What have you planted at your own house? Some flower seeds. And pumpkin seeds, too, right? Yes. And um, what else? Wildflowers. Wildflowers. Nice. Papa grows some fruit. 
Yes. Do you like helping him? He grows grapefruit, tomatoes, apricots, oranges. That's good. That's good. And what are they called? Onions or something? I don't oh, know. yeah. Those are fun. We got everything set up, so we're going to plant some stuff right now. Hello. <laughs> so first off, what do you want to plant? You want to plant cucumbers? Cilantro. Cilantro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> what are we doing? Hello. My name is Bray. <laughs> My name is Bray. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the perfect time of year is right now. It's March through May. And I'm already seven. Yes. Seven years old. <laughs> <laughs> <Did> not ask. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Bree. For us to plant these, we need to make rows. So you just copy me. I'll, I'll do the first one. So a quarter inch deep is like that deep, okay? You're gonna take your finger and try and go like that deep along the whole thing, okay? Okay. You see that? Yeah. The next one has to be at least six inches over. So you're gonna start yours right here. Uh, yeah. yeah, that works too. Sleeve and all. You got the... <laughs> There you go. That's good. Perfect. Straight. Make sure that it's all the same depth. I'll do the middle for you because it's too deep. Right. So after that, Rolly poly. Rolly poly. Next up, we're gonna crack these guys open. I'm gonna give you a few of these seeds. So you take one at a time. We're gonna take one at a time. Put them each six inches apart. So then go like that far in between each one. Okay. And then I'll do the next row. Three to harvest. It says 60 to 90 days to harvest, and that's when the vegetables are ready to be picked. It's like picking. Harvest. 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 Radish or cucumber? Cucumber. If you guys have old, I recommend this a lot. If you guys have old him. shims, shims or any small pieces of wood for gardening, they really help out for tags. So cucumber. Cucumber. How many days to harvest does that say right there? Mm, 55 days. 55 days. Hey, okay, Brie. So for these guys, we're going to go 12 inches away. So six, 12, like right here. Line up right here. This? Yep. Use your like two, use like two fingers. You can climb on the box if you need. I like your sleeve action. That works really good. Is your mom going to like that? No. <laughs> so I so put four, two seeds in each. Four seeds in each hole. So I'm going to put a hole right here. So like four in four, this one? Yeah, four just in this hole right here. One, one. two, three, four. Is that four? Yep. All right, and then can you show the camera the seeds that you got? One. Drop in here. It's all good. <laughs> so these seeds right here, um, if you guys check them out, they look pretty familiar. What are, have you ever cut open a cucumber? Yes. And and my dad has cut his thumb off. <laughs> those are actually the seeds that are in. Those are the seeds that are inside the cucumber. If you ever seen the cucumber, so you could honestly just take the seeds right out of your cucumber. You don't even have to go to the store and buy seeds. You could just cut the cucumber, save the seeds, and then put them into the ground and grow another cucumber. Isn't that crazy? Here you go. Are you all right here. Uh, should we do one or two rows, Bree? What do you think? One. Let's do two, just for safety. Aww. Just for safety. Oh, not that hard, not that hard. <laughs> okay, you just got <laughs> All right, you do it. Yeah, just, you want to dust the top of the dirt. That's good. Come here. No. Come here. Yowie. Here, it's all good. Yowie. Just like you want to, yeah. Yep, okay. Okay. <laughs> right here. Okay. No, 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 I'll make it squirt you. <laughs> Don't you? No, no, no. <laughs> so this was a full pepper. Um, and as you see, there's a bunch of seeds. You can just take these seeds and put them right into the dirt and it'll grow a whole new pepper plant and you'll have bell peppers for days. But what I like to do, you put it in a cup of warm water for a few days by the sun and then they'll actually start to sprout 
in like a hydroponic, hydroponic? Yeah, hydroponic kind of way. So if you guys have trimmings like this, save this. Any other stuff? <laughs> Straight to the compost. <laughs> Give me that. No. Give me that towel. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, what we're doing? She likes the closeout thing when I go like that on the camera. But all right, so. Thank you everyone for coming, clicking through to the new home uh, where the new <laughs> humans mother earth teaching the youth, learning every day and uh, better in the world. Brie, you want to end us out with a little closey? Yes. Do it right now. Woo!